The bus drops us at the intersection at the bottom left of this photo, and we trudge 5.5 kilometers up a mostly 45 degree incline, passing cool mushrooms like this one, until we reach the top right corner arrow indicating the ranger station, and then our actual hike begins around the Sendero El Puma. <gasps> Everything was so lush and beautiful in the cloud forest, and our guide Chico was really great. But enough of me talking. I think you should have a look for yourself. Hey, I'm filming a video. Say hi. Hey. We're at 1,222 meters. High up there. And we can see really far into the clouds. There's a lot of fog. There is a lot of. But it's, it's cool up here, though. <sighs> so it's really beautiful. We came up. That's uh, that's how we climbed up. So. We we are climbing up the stairs. I just wanted to show them to you. Say hi, Adam. How do you do? I should not be looking at my camera. I should be looking at my feet. Yeah. This is what I see. That's Chiku up there. Ah, también los peruanos. Y yeah, ah. los ecuatorianos también. Pues yo pensé que solo no, los ecuatorianos eh, dicen que de todo. We're in the clouds. Can't see anything. Twenty. So that's the fumarole, and you really can't see it, but there's steam coming out of it. Yeah. Right, Bun? You can smell it, though. Go lean over it again. It's hot. I feel it's like hot steam. Doesn't smell too bad, though. You can smell it. It doesn't smell terrible, but you can still smell it. Wow. Finally, the clouds clear and we can see for miles and miles. You can see Lake Nicaragua, over to the far left is Granada, and you can see the Isletas which were created when the volcano erupted 50,000 years ago and that's what made all those little islands. Cool, huh? Wow. We're at the, the lodge right now and we're gonna grab a cup of coffee and we're about to walk down, but look at this. Oh, it's gonna rain. It's raining. Gross. Entonces ahora van para arriba.